Hi, everybody. So I promised a mail call. As you can see, I got quite a few things to open. In yesterday's short, I had five packages there, but I was on Brewers Prospecting, and I just couldn't help myself. I started feeling hot. I was getting a fever. So I opened it, and we panned it out, and it was uh, Sluice Boys Prospecting. And I don't know if I have the gold to show you, but I did pull out the couple pickers I found. So, show those off. They had some pretty cool packaging, too. There's a little Seuss Boy sticker. And it's a little bit of smaller stuff in the snuffer bottle. You can't really see it. Not much. I'll dry it out and weigh it up. See what it had. And then I pretty wanted to show you guys that. Well, I can't find it. I'm going to show you the box that Pater came in because it was pretty cool. Had their logo on it. There it is. Nice little box. Nice packaging. You know, they could have put that towards, you know, putting some more gold in the bag, but that's just my opinion. But I'll keep that because it's a cool box. It's a nice box. All right. Gonna open this first because this is something from Banshee Mining and it's something that's really special to me. It is from the Yuba trip. She happened to snag an extra one, so she said she'd send it to me. So I already know it's in here, but we're gonna show it to you. So it's a hand towel from the North Yuba Nugget Hunt 2023. It has a little map on there of the Yuba River. It's pretty darn cool. I will keep that forever. Very good memories. There's a couple great videos out there. I know the Gold Blog just put one out with Vendetta, which was super awesome. And that sneaky turd happened to catch me in some of that video too at the end. Which was great, because I didn't have any pictures of me or video of me on the river. And I had a really big smile, so that makes me happy. Thank you, Mike. Both Mikes. Thank you, Mikes. Okay, put that back. Okay. This one is from Thomas907. So I went to California... And this is the gold that I brought back. This is the black sand that I brought back. So I ordered pay dirt so that I could have some gold as well. Can't replace the memories, but it doesn't hurt to have some shiny as well. Plus, I'm supporting my friends, which is mainly what this is all about. Wow. Wow. The pay dirt I bought. This is a one gram bag, I'm pretty sure. I've been wanting one of these for a long time and I just have not ordered one. And I actually have one. Find it. I have a, mini a miniature. Oh, I, I lied. I don't have it. It's in the house. And I'm not going out there to get it. But I have a miniature pink, or purple and a miniature pink pen. So those will be perfect. I will hang that up. Little baby RPE sluice magnet, which we're just going to hang up right now. Right here with my other magnet. Boom. My little treasure, treasure box hanging on the wall over there. Another benzo gold magnet. Have one of those, but might give that one away later. A few Thomas 907 stickers. Awesome. Probably give one one or two of those away. That's, I already have a really good Thomas 907 sticker. It's special to me. Ooh, I got a flash in your pan sticker. I 
didn't have one of his stickers before, so that's really cool. Now it will go up on my board tonight. Can Do Veteran. I have quite a few of his stickers. But I don't have this one, I don't think, so that's awesome. I'll put those on my board. Sorry, I'm not paying attention to the camera. It's one of my favorite stickers. But I have a couple of those, but I have special plans for these, I think. I have one hanging up, but I have some plans for the other ones. Well, another RPE sluice. I think that's RPE. Yep. I think he's the only one that makes these ones. Love those. Cool. Thank you, Thomas. Love you guys. Pretty much love everybody in the community. I don't think I've met a whole lot of... Two, ne two negative people, too many negative people in the prospecting community. Most everybody's been super welcoming, super nice. I just went and met a few of the prospectors down at the Yuba, and that was like super amazing. It was been talking to everybody for quite some time now, but actually hanging out in person was, was really cool. I met Home Zoo. It was really awesome. I spent a lot of time just chilling with him and Banshee, hanging out with the kids on the river. Of course, Mike and Carson and JP. There were several other people there. I could not name them all. I happened to get a few signatures on one of my gold pants, which is cool. I'll show you guys that sometime. The gold vlog, of course, he was there. I got him to sign my pan, of course. He wasn't getting away without it. Oops. I have to edit out that address there. This is, sorry, I just ripped this open before you're telling Telling you what it was. This is a lotto bag from Indiana Creek Gold Prospecting. He was selling these right before his 1500 subscriber giveaway, which is awesome. Congratulations on your 1500. This has a little bit of Rain Man mixed in with it. A3 Sky Warrior. Man, I don't know if I can open that now. No, I'm going to have to. And then just put it back in the bag. Put it on my shelf. I don't think I had any of his stickers yet, so that's really cool. Definitely happy about that. Okay, now this one. This one I've been itching to open. It's just been like whispering to me, calling me out to my little gold shed all day long. So, this is from Gold Nugget Sales. My very first bag I bought was a bicycle bag that I gave to Guido at the Nugget Hunt. So I had to, of course, reorder myself a bicycle bag, beginner's bag, and his new white horse pager that he's got out. It's, it looked good, and I haven't haven't ever panned any gold nugget sales yet, so I'm excited because everybody talks him up. I'm glad I was able to purchase this. Yeah. The good gold uh, doesn't want to be found. Can't open this package. Good packaging. I don't think any of this is going anywhere. Let's see, it's just gonna make me work for it now. That's okay. I'm just gonna tear it. I don't think I'm saving anything. Graham Beginner Bag from Gold Nugget Sales. I will probably pan that out tonight. Maybe I'll take a video. Who knows? This one I'll save for another day. Yukon Gold White Horse Pater. I've seen a couple of people show theirs off, so I'm excited to finally have mine I can show off. Yay. Lots of cool stuff from even cooler people. Honestly, I don't think any amount of gold I would have brought home would have compared to the, the memories and the people that I met. In a short couple of days on the river, we had a really good time. I wanted to hang this up, but I think I'm going to keep it in the plastic until the, uh, I get a frame or something so it doesn't get all dingy. But really awesome. Alright guys, I'm going to let you go. Um, sorry, it's not a longer video. Maybe I'll take some video of the uh, beginner bag. Pan that out tonight. 
Have a good night.